letters appearing in words, then use colour theory. So they weren't just random colours that are plucked out of the air. And you know, you have to think of different ways of seeing, and being able to touch it is really nice, because you're so used to going to galleries, and it's like, don't touch anything. Um, so that's been, yeah, really good as well. And I like that there's the coloured bits here, and then there's bits that don't use colour, and then there's a bit in the dark room. Yeah, it's a really good mix of kind of like different sensory things. There, there's obviously many uh, blind artists you know, in the world, um, but of course how many of those 